How's it going, guys? Welcome back. So we're here in the second part, or disc two, if you will, Final Fantasy VIII. Um, quick disclaimer, if you didn't catch my last video, um, I made a, just a quick introductory disclaimer regarding the version. We reverted back to the 2013 Final Fantasy VIII Steam version because the 2019 remastered version received a Steam update um, in October resulting in the mods being incompatible at the moment until they re until those mods receive uh, an update for the um the D master launcher so that's the um, that's the issue with that but I just want to make a quick disclaimer because I know some some of you guys will notice the uh the character models in particular as well that's why they are the original ones um but yeah here we are wind hill this is kind of a slower part of the game um I wanted to s kind of skip past it but I, I also wanted to show you guys just the the, uh, the modded fields real fast before we move on. So that's why I uh, proceeded on here, just to show you guys what the beauty, the masterpiece here. And these fields are just incredible. And like I said, I'm playing in the widescreen aspect uh, ratio. So if I were to put this back in the standard, uh, the 4.3. The normal native aspect ratio, if you want to call it that. It would probably be a little bit sharper. But it's feasible playing with this with the mods because it still just looks in absolutely incredible. And we have reshade. Um, let me pop this up real fast. This is what I'm running for reshade. Nothing really fancy, but just little things that kind of help make a difference. The Luma Sharpen, Vibrance, HDR. Kind of makes the colors a uh, little deeper and richer. Vibrance helps make things pop. And Luma Sharpen just kind of sharpens up those jagged edges, you know. That's... Yeah, that's a little too much right there. Alright. I always forget about this little side road, too. <laughs> But yeah, that's pretty much the extent of Windhill. Um, I don't think we checked the shop out. Let's... The hell? You recovered. <laughs> oh yeah, they hate him. But we still got a shop, right? I don't think they have anything uh, real good. Oh well, yeah, we can get some of these. Some of the stuff we don't have, right? All right, we good. I got no encounters turned on, obviously. I feel like we've earned it playing the game for 20 years. <laughs> this nice, uh, what would you call it? Nice quality of life. Nice quality of life features. Amazing. I forgot what we gotta do here. I think we have to go back and talk to the child or talk to Rain or something. And then we will mosey on over to I think we're gonna we're gonna wake up in the prison, right? If I'm not mistaken. The next uh, the next sequence of events. Girl talk. Yeah, let's come back later. Come on. Something inside me tells me to listen. Rain, aren't you gonna marry Uncle Laguna? A guy like that? He was carried in here crying like a baby, and I was the one who had to take care of him. His crude way of speaking, I don't know if his aspirations as a journalist. <laughs> I can't stand his snoring, and he talks in his sleep. Come on, that's. Isn't that the dream guy for every woman, right? But he's really nice. I really, really like him. Rain, Uncle Laguna, and El should all be together. But you know... I think what he really wants to do is travel all over the world. 
I don't think he has it in him to live in a quiet country town like this one. Some people are like that. Oh, it makes me so mad. You don't like him? I feel the same as you alone. Hiya! We certainly did come back in a hurry, didn't we? Jesus Christ, let me in. Let me over here. <laughs> Here's my report on today's patrol and monsters extermination. Including whatever the fuck he's saying there. Six monsters. <laughs> that was before I realized I had uh, Diablos and uh, no encounters. <laughs> Get me away from this music. I get scared sometimes. Scared of waking up somewhere else. Scared of not seeing alone. Scared of not seeing rain? What happened to me? I feel... What is this I'm feeling? Oh, let it, please let it be this room when I wake up. Please let me be in this puny bed when I wake up. Laguna, you changed. you damn right. Alright. On to the next turn of events. Welcome back, Zell. The dream world again? Mm-hmm. How's Laguna doing? Dunno, I didn't see him. It's not like I know everything about Ward, but... Well, you know Laguna and company want to... went to that Sentra... Sentra place and got into a real fix, right? I wanted to say Setra. I've been playing Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> After that, Ward's been all alone. He's working in some sort of prison-like place. And he's bored out of his mind. All he wants is to be fighting alongside Laguna. They'll figure it out shortly. What they're experiencing. Um, didn't you say that Ward was working in some sort of prison? And wasn't he from Gavadia? Sure, he's a soldier there. Well, since we're prisoners, shouldn't we be trying to break out of here? I... I like her, uh, thinking there. I wonder what happened to Squall. Did they bring him here, too? Correct me if I'm wrong, but aren't you supposed to be Ward in that dream world? Just now I was. Does this room look familiar? Of all the stupid questions... Well, wait, wait a second. <laughs> I know this place. Everyone, listen up. This is the prison that Ward works at. He's a janitor here. There's so many rooms just like this. Got to be here. There's a prison for polit political activists in Galbadia. This must be the place where Ward works. Right here, where we are. I'm sure of it. They're on to something. It's no surprise we're in jail. We did attack the sorceress, after all. If you went up against the president, we'll all be sentenced to death. That president is no longer in charge. Now that Galbadi is in the hands of the sorceress, what's going to happen to us? Things don't look so good. Wow. 
Time to focus on getting the hell out of here, right? All right, the man of the hour. I challenged Yidia, my wound. No wound, how? The Galbadian soldiers, we were surrounded. He was there, Cypher, leering down at me. Damn you, Cypher! He'd boost off. Because that just ruins the uh, the immersion for the cutscenes, right? I still need to dig up my um, my upscaled FMV cutscene files. I can't find those for the original. For this 2013 version. I had them somewhere, but... If you guys watched the previous videos, they, they looked pretty damn uh, spectacular. For the remastered version. What? What was that loud noise? These sons of bitches. I don't like him at all. It's the sound of your friend being tortured. What do you mean? Shut up. Don't screw around with me. You understand who's in charge here? I'm asking you a question. Jesus. Fucking brutal, man. Oh, I almost forgot. Hey, man. Is there a rhino with you? Oh, Alright, then come over here. What are you doing, a rhino, you bastard? Real gaping assholes these guys are. I'll be fine. Let's go. We need to be optimistic, right? Squall, you're pitiful. Speaking of assholes, take him away. Ha, <laughs> the, the little Moombas. I'm sure you can imagine what happens now. What do you want? Tell me what seed is. Edia demands to know. Seed. Code name. Balam Garden's elite mercenary force, Seed. Combat specialists. Don't you already know? I'm not a Seed. There must be some kind of secret you're given when you become a Seed. Yep. That's it. There's nothing. Even if there were, you think I'd tell you? You're on my tough nut to crack list. Gross. Didn't think you'd talk that easily. Geez, I'm honored. But here's a little something for you. Ow, Thumbdaga. Even if you don't talk, others will. The instructor, the little messenger girl, or that chicken wuss. He wouldn't last three seconds. He probably wouldn't. They're... They're all here? Oh, you bet. But since since I like you so much, I thought you should go first. I was hoping you'd be there, Squall. So, how'd I look in my moment of triumph? Like a straight cuck. That's how he looked. My childhood dream fulfilled. 
I have become the sorceress's knight. Sorceress's knight. His romantic dream. Just a torturer. What did you say? Like that out that that's supposed to outrage him. <laughs> Passed out cold, eh? This is the scene where you swear your undying hatred for me. Tale of the evil mercenary versus the sorceress's knight. Fun's just started, Squall. Don't disappoint me now. Zap him. I've always... I just always thought Cypher was a douche. I never really cared for his character, honestly. I guess that's... That's my unpopular opinion. It's no use. There seems to be an anti-magic field here. Huh, <laughs> walk much? You again? An asshole. Damn that numb skull. Yo, who do you think you are? Yeah, you big meanie. You stop that. Time to kick some ass. You'll regret those words. Yeah, I'm sure we will. You okay? Doesn't work so well, but... Oh, you look at that. Well now, Squall, I'll ask again. What is Seed, and why do they oppose the Sorceress? Sir, Cypher. The missiles targeted for the garden are ready to launch. Excellent. Balam Garden is to be destroyed on charges of training seeds to oppose the sorceress. <laughs> it's a pity, really. I grew up there, too. But orders are orders, and Edia wants, wants it destroyed. No. Oh. After the garden's gone, the seed hunt will begin. I'll be Edia's bloodhound. Hunt down every one of your kind. Feed Envy. That's what's going on with them. It'll be fun, Squall. Don't die on me just yet. Continue with the interrogation. Ready to talk? I don't understand the question. Don't mess with me. Edie says you know something. Now spit it out. Talk, what is Seed all about? Yeah, that'll make me talk. Aren't we mercenaries from Bell Garden Special Forces? I don't know anything. Why do you keep asking me? I'll lie. I must live. <laughs> hmm, what's that? <laughs> Flower. What did you say? A true bowl of seed to spread seeds all over the world. Fill the world with flowers. <laughs> yeah, right. It's the truth. Seeing flowers takes away people's will to fight. <laughs> what then? See, see wants to bring love and peace to the world? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. You can't fool me. We steal the will to fight. Then we invade. I love that. Yep. 
That's the whole uh, purpose behind Seed, if you guys didn't know. That's a purpose I can get behind and I can fight for. What do we do? Just stay here? We'll get tortured for sure. Nah, we'll be fine. We can't just sit here. We have to think of a way to escape. Anyone got a plan? Well, we could skin this little guy and wear him as a disguise. I'm kidding. Or is she? Doesn't sound like you are. Well, we can't rely on magic here, so we have to go with weapons. We have to somehow get them back. Weapons. My weapons are these fists of mine. I can do some serious damage without weapons. It's up to me, baby. Let me go. I'll go get the weapons back. Oh, yeah. You worked here as Ward, so you definitely know the place. Not really. All we did was mob floors. Just leave it to me, baby. You two lie down there. I hope this works. Guard, guard, we need some help. Open the door. What's the problem? The women are unconscious. I think a snake bit them. <laughs> what? Kapow. Well, I'm off. Knocked out cold. You want to go too, little guy? Alright, just don't get in the way, buddy. Well, that would be a cool little uh, mod is to, like, have him help out in battle. <laughs> With those special Moomba powers, right? Oh, we can't junction anything, right? Oh, shit, we can, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I hate using the analog stick. With the with this ver 2013 Steam version, you're forced to do it, and so you're gonna be see me do this shit going all over the place. It's so much better with it. Um, with just the D-pad, but you can't use it, fortunately. Let's keep that on there. Yeah, I think we're supposed to head up, right? I think. I went down a couple floors and I didn't get anything, so. I think the save point's kind of a, a giveaway. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Look at this. Seed weapons. That's what they call a gun blade? I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's a gun with a fucking blade. Y you an escapee? Yeah, I'm here to reclaim these. Hell yeah. Bring it on. They don't have any good things to draw. Well, I think it's overkill time. These guys get obliterated. Yep. That's what happens when you tussle with the muscle, right? Piece of cake, baby. 
All right, you hang on to these, little little guy. You carry these around. Sorry to keep you waiting. Voila. Time to go kick some ass. crazy at this point. She ain't even got any magic to junction, man. What is the point? This is the cell with the uncooperative prisoners. Yes, this is it. Please give them something to really complain about. Do we be picking on prisoners so soon after getting transferred here? Just be quiet and let me handle this. These are the prisoners, Lieutenant Diggs, Private Wedge. Well, that sounds familiar. It's these buffoons. So we meet again. Now we'll teach you the lesson we should have taught you earlier. I know it might seem cowardly to fight unarmed prisoners. But I hope you appreciate our position. Hey, it's a dog eat dog. Uh, they're fully armed, sir. What? How? Ah, hell with it. Let's go. Let's go, baby. I was demoted because of you. I'm only a lieutenant now. I'll get my revenge. Oh, boo hoo. Oh, no. A lieutenant? Oh, yeah, we're gonna be, um. We're taking. We're taking haste. That's for sure. I got to have that. I gotta see what this other shit is, though. What he's got. Hello. That's a good. Slow is good to junction towards, like, your attack. Depending on how many, you know, enemies are actually inflicted by that. Pretty good to have, too. I'll tell you what. Let's, um... Uh, see if we can knock Wedge out of the mix here. I want to junction, uh... Haste and, uh... Regen.
hope this will actually affect him. And it does, yeah. Very nice. Yeah, I'm just going to kind of spam this for a couple turns here, but it won't take too long. This is a good, good opportunity to get these two spells. She cannot draw with a shit. I think that's got to do with your your level. We cannot get that regen. Damn, man. We don't want it, right? We don't want it. Come on, baby. I just want to see it get once. <laughs> Not that we're ever going to really use it, but it's it's a good it's a good junction spell. Or like uh junction to HP or something. Yeah, we doesn't want us to get it. It's such a low level. Still one of my all-time favorite um, summon animations. I think is, I think this one in, in this version is one of the coolest. Yeah, I say we just overkill him. see how far we can get here. I don't think you can just walk out. Wall well, should be here around around here somewhere. You have any idea? Guess not. We'll find Squall and then we're out of here. Got it? I think the anti-magic field has been lifted. Should we head up? I think there's a couple of things, a couple of rooms accessible if we go up. The card guy. Cards. Okay. 
I don't really want to play cards either. We got some good cards. Okay, that's the only one for that four. What is this? Four eight, I believe. No, it doesn't tell you down there. Four nine. Draw point. There. What's up, man? Just chilling? Okay. I suppose we'll use that. Yeah, we're only about seven hours in. Because like I said, when I had to... When I realized I could just swap over to this, because I couldn't play the, the 8 remastered. I couldn't continue on with that once they broke the mods with the update. So I started a new game in this and I kind of just like... Kind of speed ran through. Just to kind of catch up to where we, where we left off, you know, and that was like part five of the video series, I believe. Hey guys, I'm really bored. You play a card game with me? I'll give you something if you win, but I'll have to charge you for the game. It's only fair, right? Two hundred gil per game. That's. You have fun with that, man. I ain't playing any card games anytime soon. So many floors. At least it's not like running up the Shinra Tower. There's 60 floors. Oh, they can unlock everything here. Hey, Squall, wake up. Come on, Squall. You okay? It was hell. Let's just get the hell out of here. Guna, Laguna. Guna. <laughs> Woo, freedom, baby. Thank goodness you're all right. Did you come here as Laguna in the dream world? No. The squall doesn't know how to get out either. Well, either way, kept going up and up. I think we better head back down. It'd be a pain to go down every floor. The alarm alerted monsters and security guards everywhere. By the way, how the hell did you, they carry you up here, squall? Pixels. That's what that is. I don't think the version of uh, the mods that I have really touched that that model of whatever that crane thing or whatever <laughs> oh so this big hole goes all the way down to the bottom so if we jump all the way down we're out of here yep oh yeah I remember now we can move this arm by using the panel above the control room I remember Ward doing this but we need to operate them both at the same time 
I'm gonna need to stay up the stairs and control the panel. Well, you're the one who knows how to control it, so. I'll give you instructions from upstairs. Everyone get inside. Oh, that looks great. That's amazing. So this is the armed control room. Yo, can you guys hear me? Hey, Zell. Loud and clear. So what do we do? Press the red button on the main panel. No, sorry, I'm confused, man. I need a thumbnail. I'll take care of the rest. Okay, so what are we going to do now? Well, there's a door over there. And... Let's check it out. That's a grand idea. But first... We need to switch junctions. Hey, buddy. Barry, do you mean we're underground? In any case, we can't get out from here. Gunfire. There he is, over there. It's easy escapee, dead or alive. No, 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 no. He runs fast as fuck. I just took the junction off, too. I am stupid. I was not thinking about that. Oh, well. <laughs> Duh. Okay, so the controller buttons don't translate to that. That's stupid. That is so annoying. Wow, I have to use the keyboard for that. That is so dumb. This is mega bullshit, man. It says press B, and then when you press B, it says press B and H. Is there a workaround for that? That's so fucking annoying. Because it's... I think you have to mess with the key bindings, but those still aren't gonna affect. Because look, I'm pressing... I'm pressing B on the keyboard to confirm. And I haven't changed anything, and it's not working. It tells me to do that. So stupid. I'd say if there's one thing that I do indeed miss from the remaster, it's that. The Squall? Or Irvin even have anything on? I don't think he had. Yeah, so we should be able to switch junctions with one of these other clowns. Yeah, give him some, give him some HP, right? We'll keep it there so he can use his limit break. Hell yeah! Nice entrance. Didn't think you'd go down that easy. Thanks, man. <laughs> Bonk right on the head. all that important to you? Oh, 
only way we can get out of here. Oh, but there is. Quick draw, McGraw. All right, heading back down. We just had our first game crash. I don't know why, but we're back at it. So <laughs> all should be well now. Yeah, I just did it out of the blue randomly. I've really had that issue with this game, so I don't know what mods or what issues could be arising. Shouldn't be a whole lot left to this part, though, where we get out of this prison area. Okay. Let me make sure we still have our junctions. Yeah, we do. I'll never get used to that. I have to the fact that I have to use the analog stick. I can't use the D-pad for some reason with this uh, version. Got a free cottage though. Just admiring the backgrounds, man. That's amazing. See nothing back here. Oh yeah, we're out, baby. Almost. Here they come. All that speed boost. Before we get wrecked. Man, this battle background looks fantastic. Look at this. You're not going anywhere. Man, this is amazing. He's got nothing good on him. Uh, these guys have haste. I'm gonna try and draw that real fast. <laughs> Let's do a couple of rounds of draws. Haste is a uh, quick and easy thing to... Quick and easy junction for speed at this point in the game until we get later on with like triple and stuff. Say what? He's got aura, but we can't fucking draw it, dude. Man, that's whack. I would totally take aura right now. That's a good shit, man. Oh, one's out of the fight. That was easy. Too easy. <laughs> holding, holding the invisible sword, you know. Hey, Squall, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Hey, hey, you guys. What you're talking about? I can hear you. Told you we'd be all right. Well, go ahead and operate the arm. We'll leave that one up to Zell since he knows the area. He knows what he's doing. 
Alrighty. We'll be there in like a second. Wait right there. Like they'll be just fine. Woo. No speed boost. What the hell is this? We still can't go anywhere. No way, when I came in earlier it wasn't like this. Let's just head for that structure over there. A weird looking prison. I'll see if I can dig up. I know I have some, uh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait, am I going the right way? Or am I supposed to be going the other way? <laughs> um. I know I have the, uh. 1080, uh, FMV file somewhere. For this game. I'll have to dig those up, see if I can get them in for the next one. Get them in by the next video. I thought I failed that for a second. <laughs> that was way too dangerous, wasn't it? Yep. I thought the arms were moving kind of slow. They had the submerged system on. Let's just get going. I want to ride the yellow one. Well, of course you do. Let's go, Irvin. Awesome. And we're out. That's a bright screen. What? The sorceress is about to launch missiles at Garden? That's what Rhinoa heard from Irvin. The only thing we can do now is go back to the, to the Garden as soon as possible and warn the students. Alright, let's get in the car and go. They're targeting both Balam and Travia Gardens. We have to interfere with the launch. We have to stop the missiles. I'll do whatever Squall decides. Of course you will. So like, I understand how Selfie feels, but... This isn't just about Selfie. Hmm, the missile base plan. You go talk to Selfie. There we go. She's got it all figured out then, huh? She got a whole plan? I just transferred from Travia Garden. I can't just sit around knowing that Travia Garden is in danger. Well, Squall, please. Decide who's going to... Decide who's going to go to the uh, Galbadia missile base before it's too late. Easier said than done. What if something happens to the party members I choose? Let's take a vote. Squall will decide on the party. Squall will return to the Balam because he's a leader. Anyone against this plan, please raise your right hand. I don't mind which team you put me on. You're the leader, Squall. What are the teams? Leader. I never asked to be the leader. Whatever. <laughs> Classic squall. I heard they were hitting Travia first and then Balam.
They never miss. Well, we have to report to Balam. Who are you taking? These guys are really pushy. I've had it up to here with this leader thing. All right, all right, I'll choose. How about, yeah. I'm on the missile base infiltration team. I have to be. They launch missiles at my Trabia. This team will now head for Balam. The rest to the missile base. Should I go with this? Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to swap. I don't know. I think I'm just going to swap the team. It doesn't really matter. We'll be fine either way. That'll do. This mission is unlike, unlike any other. It's not an order or a request from anyone. Selfie, do you have some kind of plan? I think if we take this Galbadian army vehicle, we should be able to make it inside the base. But that's about it. I'll have to think about the rest once we're inside. That's risky. You think that'd be okay? I'm sorry, I mean, thanks. There isn't much time, you better hurry to Balam Garden. See you there. So the next one should be pretty fun. Infiltrating the uh, missile launch base.